What's up everyone? Today we're going to be doing another um, journal vlog and today it is for Northern Hills Golf Club. And it was a, uh, so yeah, it was a U.S. Kids Tournament. Um, ten year olds from the ladies tees. Yay, ladies tees. Yeah, ladies tees are always fun, right? Alright. So, we played from the ladies tees. Today was, um, it was actually cold. Finally, for like the past seven, the uh, past week, it's actually been like super hot. It's actually been in the 90s here in Texas. And, um, so yeah, today, um, the other day it was cold. I mean, yeah, today it was cold. Very, very chilly. And windy. I think, I think it was probably the wind that made it cold or not so much of the temperature. But more, more of the wind. Maybe more like north wind. Probably. So, yeah. So, I think I only had one problem that, that... Um, that was really wrong in my game, and I don't think no setup was clear as heck. It was like super good. Like I we picked out the video, and there's like not much you can really find wrong with my setup. There's only one little thing that um messed up my round a little bit. It was um not. Folding my pose. So let's say take a swing and when you're on the toe, on your toe, following through, I wasn't actually keeping it there until the ball stopped. I was like, if you might have noticed, I might have, um, I was, um, I was going at the top and then like walking backwards, um, and not holding it as. So I was like going up there for like a second and then walking back. Like some of them I didn't even try to hold my pose. Well, I tr of course I tried to hold my pose. I just did something wrong on my swing or it's a habit, me walking back and doing that. So that was pretty much the only thing. That that caused the um, double bogey on eight, which um, was I was not very happy with. So, the double bogey was just because of the drive, because I had um, not holded my pose, so I didn't time it correctly, and I didn't hold my pose, so that's like double whammy bad. And then it went like off super left into the trees, almost out of bounds. And... Um, then I had to get out and then hit on and three putt and I was already mad at myself because I had already um I was mad at the drive already. But that's not what caused the rest of it to happen. The what caused my emotions to go up was the whole before number seven when I hit a second shot short and we were arguing, so that was that's what um, started. I mean, I got par in the last hole, but um, we just started arguing, and I think that's why the emotional hang up. But technically, it was because of I didn't hold my pose and didn't time it. That that's they're two different things. So yeah. So it's pretty much not out the round. Hey, I finally won a U.S. Kids. Yay! One U.S. Kids. One. Um, how many is left? Fourteen. Three more to win. And if I win Cedar Creek coming up next week, I will, I'll be happy too. And if I win, um, Fort Sam after that, I'll also be happy. So, then really I'll be way ahead on the points but um if I win those first two like it's it's easy win 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 I don't have to go to the championships at the end because I already have enough points to win like even if someone wins there they're not going to be able to catch up I mean I can just like walk along the sides but yeah so hmm 
I don't know. Maybe I won because Shiv wasn't there, but I don't think so because um, that win was crazy. Like, everyone screwed up. I had, like, the best nine holes, and my friend Jackson, um, Bade, he had the best, um, he had the best, um, 18 holes. He plays 18, I play 9, but we're still friends. But, guess what? The, since he, the reason he won is because he shot the same exact score as me. Just doubled. So, I shot 39, he shot 39, 39. So, I'm guessing that was the only way to win, because that was the best, um, that was going on in that win today. Um, but... I'm still proud of myself because I know North um, Northern Hills is a hard course, but I also recognize that Cedar Creek is super hard. Well, for me, anyways, but it's a difficult course for in general. So, mm -hmm. so I'll be looking forward to that and. Swing issues today, maybe, maybe some little things there, like on my putting, like my stance was wide a little bit, and um, in in my regular swing it was wide too. Um, and sometimes maybe I went a little flat in here instead of up here, but that's probably it. I mean. That course was hard, especially with the wind. And if it was into the wind, you'd only hit your drive like 130, even if you hit it super good. One of the holes on um, number, let's see, the hole where I hit three wood on the second shot. After the par three where I almost got par, the uphill one, um, that hole I hit a good driver actually. I didn't hold my pose. I didn't hold my pose for mostly any of my shots. But what I liked about that hole is that I had a second shot as a three wood. And I hit a super good one. And if I didn't hit it as well, it would have went short of the green. But if I, w I hit that one little thing that made it fly and then hit a giant cut because of the wind. And then it landed on the green. So that was my favorite hole. Either that one or the hole before the uphill part of three. I thought I was going to roll off the back, like, like, because last time, well, last time I was hitting a club that was too long, but we didn't expect it because we were on an upslope, so we couldn't tell. And if you hit it just, like, Four or five yards longer than you're supposed to, it's gonna go rolling down the hill and off the back. So it's like it's an you're on an uphill slope, but a downhill green. So you're going like wham, and you're trying to land it like right here, so it just stops on the green. Now it wasn't really downhill; it's just more down sloped and smaller. And they put the pin in the smaller area of the green, because the green is like down sloped like this. Like, this is where the pin is right here, and then the green is down slope down here. So then there's, like, a slope that you have to go up, and the pin's over here. And if you leave it short, it's, like, a big slope. So I hit the left of the hole, and then I hit a little cut, and then it landed just off the back, and then I two by it for bar. So, yeah, that was my favorite hole. And then the... So the last two holes got me, but... It was good enough to win, and pretty much. Also, um, two things. One, yes, I got a haircut. And two, shout out to um, Phoenix Guerra, who has a who is a good friend of mine and a follower on my channel. And I was just going to say hi, what's up, Phoenix? And um, so yeah, thanks. Thanks to him, I have a good supported channel. If you like this video, leave a like and a comment below. And I'll see you in the next video. Either, well, I, I'll, show, show, I'll show my face 
had the next vlog for Cedar Creek. And I'll see you in the next video, which is um, U.S. Kids Cedar Creek.